Hello, class. How are you doing? Fine. Thank you. And you? I'm good. Thank you for asking. How's everything coming out today? Good? Bad? Maybe. Who is Melissa Trujillo? Okay. Hi, teacher. Hi, Melissa. How are you? I'm fine, and you? Great. All right. Good. Do you have a camera, uh, Giovanni Garcia? And Alba? Hi, yeah. Okay, please connect your cameras. Okay. Because it's a requirement from Insafort. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Remember yesterday we were learning about you have to and you must. Correct? Yes, we did. Yes, thank you. What is the difference between you have to and you must? Evelyn, hold on, hold on. Nobody help. Let's Actually, ask it was shoe. Shoe. You, should. Should and must. Um, Yes. No, but it was have to and must. No. Should and must. Should and must. Yesterday, we, we didn't say you have to? No, we didn't. Okay, but you know what is have to, right? Remember I told you the difference? You have to use a seatbelt or you must use a seatbelt? You should use a seatbelt or you must use a seatbelt. That's what you said yesterday. It wasn't have to. Because you should, it's an advice. Shouldn't have to, it's an advice. Uh-huh. And what is must? It's like... Um, uh recommendation but you said that it's about something legal uh, or that it has to be we have to do it but in a legal way i, I don't know like the seedbed you know yesterday i i think i slept i slept like this all night uh, Man, all oh, my my left side of my body hurts. I put kofal like all day. Hmm. It hurts. It takes some days to. Yes. Okay. Um. Yes. Remember, must is a legal obligation. Yes, it's not optional. My SOS is not optional. You must. Como se llama? Child support. Do you know what is child support? Child, the children, right? Child, the hijo. 
Support, yes. support a hijos, creo que es. Manutención. La pensión. No, el hombre irresponsable que no paga lo de sus hijos. La pensión. La... Ah, no. La demanda del... Mantención. La demanda del... Mantención. Manutención, manutención. Manutención, yes, thank you. Yes. So, uh, imagine, yo no estoy en eso y jamás en mi vida lo estaré, pero imagine I am. So, I have to pay child support or I must? You must. Not. Yeah, si mi esposa me demanda y yeah, estoy, I must. Y hey, dicen que hoy los meten presos, so. So that's good. Yes, so it's a legal obligation. Remember to go to the United States, you have to have a visa or you must have a visa. You must have a visa. You must have a visa, yes, good. Yeah. Um, Hold on, let me check one thing. I want to pass something to you, but I can't share in Zoom. Hold on, let me check. Let me, I, I want to share something with you, but let me see if I can share with you in Zoom. I can't. Chat to everyone. Let me see. Tell me, can you see what I just passed? No. Check in the chat. Okay. Yes. That's pretty interesting. Look, it's how you say the time. Así se dice la hora. Do you see it? Yeah. So that, that's that's something interesting. Or if you don't want to complicate, use the original time, 8:25. 8:5, 8:10. Okay. Let's do the next. We're going to talk about celebrations now. Okay, so um, do you see my screen? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. Um, yes. Do you know what is anniversary? Correct. Yes. 
cake. We understand cake, cards, dancing. What is fireworks? Mm -hmm. We have flowers, fruit punch, fruit punch. En buen salvadoreño, fresco de ensalada. <laughs> Parade. Parrillada. No. You know now, uh, okay, for example, parade. Remember the day, the international day of, of the gays of home. I'm sorry, no sé si lo estoy diciendo. Bien. Desfile. Desfile, it's a parade. Uh, like, for example, the gays, they, they did a parade. The gay right. parade. Mm -hmm. No confundir con manifestations. It's a civic. Yes, it's a parade. It's, it's a celebration for something. Gay, gays celebrate a lot. So it's a gay parade. <laughs> um, pets, uh, animal, international animal parade. Next, we have party. What is presents? Regales. Roast turkey. Eh, rostizado. Rostizado. Uh -huh. rostizado. And we have a wedding. Boda. Yes. Boda. Um, Carmen, how long have you been married? I have 14 years. I have been married. Sorry? Repeat, I have been married. I, I have been married for 14 years. Good. Do you celebrate your anniversaries? Yes, each year. Okay, good. Um, Gustavo, do you celebrate with fireworks in Christmas? Uh, actually not. Since... I don't know, maybe when I was 17, the last time. I, I think people don't really celebrate with fireworks anymore. Not like, yeah. remember 15 years ago, man. Yeah. This, since December yeah. 1, you... No, you don't. All right. Giovanni, do you like to go to parties? Yes, I like to go to the party in my work. All right. Uh, with my family, um, with my friends. Good. All right. Okay, let's listen to this video and listen, pay attention to the vocabulary we heard. We did. Hi, are you ready to begin? I want you to follow me and repeat the words as they appear in your screen. Anniversary, cake, cards, dancing, fireworks, flowers, fruit punch, parade, presents, roast turkey, wedding. Very good. Remember you may listen to the audio program as many times as you need to. Okay, so let's start with this. Carmen, can you please? Okay, so I ask you, Carmen, how do you celebrate Christmas in your family? Well, with my family, um, we celebrate the Christmas on December 40, 40, 24th. Okay. And what do you do? Do you meet with your family? Eat, do you eat turkey, ham, or tamales? <laughs> Normally, we we cook uh, turkey. Okay. And make a dinner with all my family, nuclear family. Okay. First, first with my parents-in-law, mm -hmm. and after that with my my parents too. 
Okay. Where do your parents live? My parents live in, in near to my parents, really, in Colonia de la Cat, maybe in 15 minutes of difference between oh, them. Oh, okay. So that's good. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Okay, Carmen, thank you very much. Can you please ask somebody, how do you celebrate? Uh, anything, okay. Christmas, okay. birthdays, in, how do you celebrate anniversaries? How do you celebrate in the office? Okay, Gustavo Correa, how do you celebrate the Valentine's Day? Wow, well, um, how many Usually, do you celebrate? Only one? What? How many Valentine's Days do you celebrate? Only one? Not really. Uh, because Valentine, not a big celebration, right? Just mm, uh, flowers and chocolates, but not big celebration. It's more, it's more like a um, casual date. And another day, any another day, uh, we try to make some special dinner like that. Yeah, but women don't like to hear that. Uh, my girlfriend is a little different. She oh, doesn't man. like to, because it's too crowly every, every place. You have to marry your girlfriend. She likes <laughs> hardware stores. She doesn't celebrate Valentine's. Does she like soccer? No. Oh. That's everything can be good. Yeah, okay, good. So how do you so so you don't celebrate Valentine's? No. Not like big celebration. It's like okay, normal date. Okay. Oh, that's good. But when you're married, you don't celebrate Valentine's. When you're boyfriend, girlfriend, yes. Yeah. But when you're married, you don't need to celebrate. Really? Nope. It's more like anniversary. Because you're married. Day. You're married, so you don't need to celebrate. You need, teacher, because... But, you're, but you're, for your anniversary, it's like your... Valentine's Day. Yeah, because you know, you have to celebrate your anniversary, your birthday, Valentine's, and this and that and this and that. So, uh, no, no, I'm joking. <laughs> Yo le doy los chocolates que me dan en el trabajo. Yes, I go here. yes, here, baby. Happy Valentine's. All right, Gustavo, ask somebody, please. Uh, Genaro. Hi. How do you celebrate um, Christmas at work? Mm, I celebrate in party in the okay. world. Nice. Even now with the COVID? The, the last year's no celebration. Okay. And this year? Mm, I don't know. Oh. I think uh, no. Okay, good. Good. <laughs> Thank you. Good question. Okay, Hanaro, your turn. Ask somebody, please. Um, Norma. Hi. How is a uh, celebration? Uh, is Mother Day? Yes, I celebrate Mother's Day. But well, that's um, not the question. What? The question is how do you oh, repeat the question, Hanaro? How do you celebrate Mother's how, Day? How do you celebrate Mother's Day? 
I celebrate um, with, uh, I, I know I don't, I don't have mother. My, my mother is dead. I celebrate with my co-worker. Okay. Um, Are you a mother? Yes. And you I don't have, celebrate? Yes, I celebrate with my co-worker. I, I celebrate with my far and my husband and with my family. Yes. All right, good, good. Okay, your turn. Okay. Um, I think. Your option, except uh, Carmen Gustavo and Genaro. Car Alba Roxana. Alba Roxana. Yes. How, how do, como es la pregunta, teacher? How do? How do you celebrate? Mm -hmm. Where do you celebrate? When do you celebrate? But the objective is celebrate. Uh, when, how do you celebrate uh, your birthday? Good. Birthday. Birthday, yes. Your, baby, your birthday. Okay, well. Actually, my friends and my family prepare something for me. Uh, I celebrate it with my friends. We go to eat something and then we have karaoke uh, with my family. It's different. We have, uh, we spend some time and we have, uh, they sing me and Sometimes they prepare panes con pollo, chicken, bread. Uh, I don't know how to say it, teacher. <laughs> what is a pan con pollo? Pan con pollo is uh, like the ones that we eat, we eat in Christmas. I don't know if somebody here do it, but that's what actually my family prepare for me because I like it and I just eat them on my, on my birthday and in Christmas. Okay, good. Pan con pollo is a chicken sandwich. Okay, chicken sandwich. So okay. listen, don't think that sandwich is only pan de carne. No, 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 it's not, no. Sandwich is something between bread. Okay. But what, what is the difference between a pan con pollo and a chicken sandwich? That maybe pan con pollo, si lo queremos hacer más autóctono, it's a Salvadorian chicken sandwich. Ah, okay. Porque si usted dice literalmente en inglés, pan con pollo, sería chicken with bread. So visually, people that don't know, they will imagine the chicken and the bread. Yeah. They will not imagine the sandwich. So okay. imagine, uh -huh. so what do you do in Christmas? We celebrate, oh, we celebrate, we make Salvadorian chicken sandwiches. Okay. All right, yes. Very good, your turn. Okay, um, let me see. <laughs> Evelyn, Evelyn Mariela. <laughs> Hi. Yes. Hi. Evelyn, how do you celebrate New Year? Uh, I go to San Miguel with my boyfriend and we have dinner with my family. And we... Is your boyfriend from San Miguel? No, he's from Santa Tecla. Okay. But I spend Christmas in Santa Tecla and so we go. New Year here in uh, San Miguel. Yes. Yes, that's, that's okay. great. And we we eat a lot of food, uh, <laughs> and we <laughs> some results like eat twelve grapes. Uh, uh, twelve. Oh, you do that tradition. You eat the yes. twelve grapes. Yes, we do the tradition. We and. Do you drink beer and tequila? No, when. I, I don't drink. 
Uh, It'd be wine. Wine, yeah. Wine, wine, yeah. And just that. Oh, yeah. All right. Good for you. Good for you. Okay, your turn. Okay, no more Christmas and no more birthdays. Let's do something different. Francisco, Javier. Hi. Hi. Uh, how do you celebrate Father's Day? Mother, Mother Day. Father. You are Thursday. Father. Oh, Thursday, okay. Yeah. Uh, I celebrate meeting with my family and, and eat, eat dinner. All right, good, your turn. Please ask, okay. I think we're finished. Okay, please ask me. Hey. Hey, teacher. Hello. Teacher, how, how do you celebrate the day of love and friendship? Now? San Valentine. No, San Valentine. Uh, I, I don't really celebrate San Valentine's. <laughs> okay. Um, because, but you know, like what Gustavo says is true. Valentine's Day, everything, everything is full. Okay. Um, let me another ask. Um, uh, how do how do you celebrate your anniversary with your wife? Now, I don't help. No. <laughs> We go out, that day we go out. We go out, drink and listen to rock bands. Okay, sure. And get very drunk. <laughs> yeah, only that day. I have a friend that he has a rock band and he plays very, very good. Do you remember Fuga Bronco? Yeah, so the singer, he's a very good friend of mine. So I always call him. Where are you tonight? Oh, I'm here. Where are you? So I give him the list of the songs. So it's cool. Hey, play, play U2, play Bon Jovi, play Pink Floyd, play the police. So it's interesting. Do you celebrate religious days well christmas is religious maybe a holy a holy week in maybe a holy week on april okay okay do you yes. celebrate do you celebrate that yes yes we go to the prairie too well okay. before the covid yes uh -huh. Do you celebrate Thanksgiving? Not We didn't celebrate. We don't. We don't, sorry. Why not? Because the Thanksgiving is not a traditional celebration in El Salvador. It's for United States. Yes, it's a United States only tradition. Mm. Do you know the story of Thanksgiving? So, so. Let me you, ex you, you told us I told about you the Black Friday. What is the... Oh, the history of Black Friday. Yes, but not for Thanksgiving. Okay, I'm going to explain to you that history, but I'm going to explain to you and in very short term in in england in england there was a religious war 
guerra religiosa. So the church, usted católico, no. They started killing people. Remember, because religion was very, religion and politics, wild, right? So there were some Protestants, Protestants, and they wanted to escape Europe. Escaparse. So they decided to come to America. But similar like in Cuba, so I'm not about to let's go. Where? I don't know. Just go. When they came to America, obviously by New York, uh, Atlantic, I think, oh man, I don't remember. It was two ships. It was two ships with 80 people in each ship they died not all of them but eventually they died because um, they couldn't survive because United States is very hot in summer very cold in winter so many died and there was a group of Indians in America that were watching them for many months. The MSS, they were just watching them. Cuando se dieron cuenta que no eran, eran inofensivos, the Indians decided to help the pilgrims. Los peregrinos. So the Indians decided to help. So then the Indians came and says, hi, look. The Indians taught, pasado de teach, the Indians taught the pilgrims how to kill animals, how to plant, how to cook, how to survive. The Indians. Gran error. What happened? More pilgrims came and more came and more came. And the pilgrims in America, ya les enseñaban como, okay, look, this is how to survive, etc. So one day, the pilgrims, they were very happy. And they say, wow. This is thank you to the Indians. Let's invite the Indians to dinner. Yes. So they invited the Indians to dinner. And um, that's, I think the party was three days. And the dinner was saying thank you to the Indians because you, because of you, we survived. Do you understand? Y para terminar, años después, les quitaron sus tierras, los obligaron a hablar inglés y los hicieron esclavos. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, when, ya cuando ya implementaron políticas and this and that and this and that, y hoy son minoría. So, por eso hay mucha gente que también no está muy de acuerdo con celebrar eso. Es como la gente que celebraba el día de Columbus, de Cristóbal Colón. So, that was the celebration. That's, that's Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving is maybe biggest holiday in the United States. The biggest. More than Christmas y todo. So it's, it's a very good business. 
In El Salvador, I understand if we celebrate, but maybe because you are from the United States and you live here, tiene lógica. Pero tengo unos vecinos que celebran, ni saben por qué. Hoy que hay acción de gracias. Really, man? Really? Do you know the story? No, man. <laughs> so that is, the, that is the story of Thanksgiving. Como decían, cuando vinieron nosotros teníamos el oro y las tierras, ellos trajeron la Biblia. Después ellos se quedaron con el oro y la tierra y nosotros con las Biblias. Como los obligaron a, a hacerse religiosos y todo. Y hoy, hoy hay una gran, oh, bien pequeña, la, la, es una minoría. De, eh, se, los indios se llaman indios nativos. Que realmente son los verdaderos americans. Ok, so, that is the story of Thanksgiving. So, do you think... Do you think it, it was a, como, parecía como si está diciendo malas palabras. Beep, beep. Do you think, uh, do you think it was a bad idea for Indians to help the pilgrims? Absolutely. Yes. But I think the Indians never imagined. Yeah, yeah. Of course, they don't imagine that will be hap that what it will happen. Yes. Un día que puedan vean un video estuvo bien bien chivo de. Se acuerdan cuando Donald Trump era presidente. Y ese hombre causó mucho odio y iras y todo. Y había una que había mucha gente blanca protestando contra los latinos como váyanse de aquí, migrantes y no sé qué. Como go home, go home. Y llegó una comunidad de indios nativos. Y le dicen, you go home. I am America. This is my land. Ustedes vinieron aquí y nos robaron todo. Dice, you are not American. Pero bien chicos, so llegaron los, los indios nativos como a apoyar a los latinos. Diciendo, eh, nosotros siempre estuvimos aquí este, antes que ustedes vinieran. It was good. Ok, so let's continue. With. Next, it says. By the end of this class, you will understand the use of relative clause of time. Clauses of time. So let's see what clauses of time is. Esta pobre chera siempre la ponen. Le, le ponen pausa en el peor momento. Kind of scary. Yeah, look, she's scary right there. But she's not. Okay, let's listen. Hello. Before you watch the video, I want you to know what a relative clause is. So pay attention. A relative clause is used to define or identify the noun that precedes them. In this case, we will talk about the relative pronoun when because we want to talk about time. Okay. What? <laughs> Man, I, okay. Yeah, that. Okay, look, a relative clause is a word. So after that word, for example, when you say when, it's a time. So when I was a kid, I used to love Christmas. 
Now I don't. Because when I was a kid, I had no obligations. Yes, only wait, only wait. Now, no, I have to go to the supermarket, buy the turkey, go to the supermarket, buy the sodas, take the turkey to the... I don't enjoy, so when I come home, I'm tired, like... Uh, but I, I now, yeah, I, I love Christmas, but I remember when I was a kid, I enjoyed Christmas more. Um, tell me about something when you used to live in San Miguel, Evelyn. What did you used to do on the weekends? Ir a metro. I didn't go on metro, to metro. Uh, I remember everybody uh, goes to metro on the weekends. Because it's the only place that you yeah. can visit, I think. Yes, it's true. Um, when I was in, in San Miguel, I go to eat uh, Alegría on weekends with my family. Pupusa. Alegría, Usulután. Oh, okay. Alegría is Usulután. Yes. Okay. So uh, on weekends we go, we we went to eat pupusas. All right. Okay. Good. Giovanni Garcia, how old are you? I am forty years old. Forty years old. Who did you used to like? Or who did you used to love when you were a little boy? Um, when I was a little boy, I like it. Uh, I used to like. I used to like uh, play soccer. <laughs> no, but, visit, but, but visit listen, the park. My, my question is direct because I didn't say what did you used to like. I said who. Who? Uh, like Sabrina, remember Sabrina? Boys, 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 looking for some action, boys. boys. It's so, a so good song. It's a good song. Um, and a good video. Yeah, but in my case, I like. Uh, I used to like. I used to like uh, listen to my crew. Okay. No, but my question is, okay, look, I remember when I was a little boy, I used to like very much Marisa Tomei. I don't know. <laughs> um, Marisa. Marisa Tomei. I used to like Brooke Shields. I used to like Winnie Cooper. Do you remember Winnie Cooper from the Wonder uh, Years? The Wonder Years. Yeah. Man, the Wonder Years. I, I still <laughs> like her. I She's beautiful now. <laughs> So yeah. who did you used to like when you were a little boy? Uh, when I was a child, I used to like um, Winnie Cooper, uh, and this cake, Winnie Cooper. Um, Madonna too, Madonna was beautiful. Madonna. So, yeah. I mean, example. No, but I used to like Madonna when I was a little kid. Papa, don't preach. She, she. I like Madonna. Now I don't like Madonna. All right. Very good. Francisco, who did you used to like when you were single? <laughs> mm. I know, I know. You can't answer. I know you can't answer. Yeah, but, I, no, no. Ask. Wait, wait. Let me see. When when you were in in school, okay. what did you used to buy in the store? When when I when I were when I was when I was in school. When I was, 
No quisiera ser más difícil formularla. Ok, let me repeat the question. Okay. When you were in school, what did you used to buy? When in I the was store. in this school, when I was in, in this school, I used to buy uh, sorpresas. I don't know, we say, uh, yeah, las cositas que traían unos muñequitos adentro. All right, good. Yeah, very good. All right, good. Alba. Yes, where, teacher. <laughs> where did you used to live when you lived in San Salvador? Um, I used to live in San Martin when I was a teenager, yes. yes. But are you from San Salvador originally? Actually, no, I was born in San Alejo, La Unión, but I grew up in San Salvador. I used okay. to live in San Martin and Ilopango and Soyapango. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But all you need is a popa. Mm. <laughs> yeah. And so, I will complete it. <laughs> and you're complete. You are untouchable. Okay. <laughs> I always confuse Ilopango and San Martin because I, I, I never know where is the, the border, the, 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 the division. Yeah, there because is a, like a definition. Carcel de Mujeres is Soyapango, no? Yes. Or Ilopango. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah it, like. I think, I think that's the... Um, it's Soyapango, I think. Soyapango. Air, Air Force is in Ilopango and Carcet de Mujeles is Soyapango. Maybe it's near to the limit. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Near to the limit, I think. Yeah, you're right. Okay, it's in the limit. Okay, good. All right, so you understand that is a time clause. Saben que en vez de decirle time clause, yo le diría más palabra de tiempo. Porque cuando uno dice when, of course, it's a time. Yes? Yes. All right, let me see what else is next. Oh man, my coffee is very strong. Very strong today. Let me see. You want to sleep tonight. <laughs> oh, no, I will. I have no problem sleeping. It's an ability. I used okay. to drink a lot of coffee when I was in high school. Oh, yeah? Yeah. But, but the sobrecito, the sobre cafe listo. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's not coffee. Mm -hmm. uh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, okay, that's, okay, okay. <laughs> no, I, I drink real coffee. So yo muelo mi café antes de tomarlo. Tengo el molino. Y después lo pongo a hacerse. Y, yeah. Have you ever yeah. tried café de palo? Yes. Yeah, it's good. It's good, yes. It's good. Okay, number one. New Year's Day is when... Brazilians, people have their parties. Many young adults choose to get married. People in many countries honor workers. People express their love to someone. People sometimes play tricks on friends. People have one. parties with family and friends. Second one. People have parties with my family and friends. Okay, April Fool's Day is when? April Fool's Day, I think here is November 1. It's like a Santos, Dia de los Santos. Inocentes. No, de los Santos Inocentes. Yeah. Mm. Sex. It's on December 28th. Oh, it's December 28th. Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. 
-hmm. Es cuando engañan a la gente, right? Yes, yes. It's a joke. Is they celebrating Antiguo Bucatlán? Y Naiv debería sacar algo como, quiero comunicar que voy a retirarme del cargo. Or something. I don't know. People get happy. Or no, solo para. Just <laughs> kidding. Yeah, I'm kidding. Oh. <laughs> April Fool's Day. So April Fool's Day is when? People sometimes play tricks on friends. Tricks on friends, good. When I was a kid, I remember one time my girlfriend, my ex-girlfriend, she told me, I'm pregnant. What? You're pregnant? Oh my God. Pero me tuvo así dos días, like. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ay. Are you talking to, to the coyote? How much to put me in United States? <laughs> no, pero me vengué bien rico. What did you do? I told her, because she told me, I, I think it was a, like, In that time, my, my, my girlfriend, she went to Mexico with her mother on vacation or something. Okay. And she called me, David, I'm pregnant. What? Are you sure? Yes. Oh, my God. And, and for two days, I was depressed. And then when she calls me and she says, ha, 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 ¿verdad que te creíste? Yo, oh, my God, so you're not pregnant? No. Juramelo. Yes. No, no, no. Please promise. I promise. <laughs> she says, why? Yo ya hablé con tu papá. <laughs> and she screamed like, what? Wow. <laughs> <Get on. laughs> y aguantan, ella se enojó. Se enojó conmigo, no, no me habló hasta que volvió. Pero, hey, si van a hacer una broma, aguanten. <laughs> May and June are the months when many young adults choose to get married. Many young adults choose to get married. En El Salvador es December. May and December. Maybe because it's the flower month. No, I think it's March. Porque mm -hmm. ya, okay, look, February is Valentine's Day, right? Yeah, el mes, hey, I'm pregnant. Oh my God. Hmm. Me, I think, I think I was, um, I was an experiment of. I think I was an experiment of, of because I was born in November. <laughs> <laughs> so February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, nine months. <laughs> I was born in November. Who? You too? Yes. yes. Yeah. You were, you were. You were conceived in a celebration. Yes. <laughs> okay, Valentine's Day is a day when? People express their love to someone. They love someone. When people express their love to someone, right? Labor Day is a day when? People in many countries, other workers. Yeah. Labor Day in El Salvador is May 1st. May 1st. When people, what is it? Mm -hmm. 
People in many countries, honor work. Honor workers. Where is it? There are four. four. One, two, three. Okay, there you go. February is the month when? Brazilian celebration. Brazilian celebrate the carnival. Mm -hmm. Hey, Evelyn and, and Gustavo, did you go to the carnivals in San Miguel? Yeah. Do you go to the street or to a private? Street. Both. Yeah, both. Yeah, both, both, but, both, but. But the street is the best. The street is the jungle. I remember, I remember one time I went and in the carnival in downtown, eran cuatro, like, here in one side it was Nietzsche. And in front, it was like a square. One. So it was Nietzsche, Sonora Dinamita, um, Aniceto Molina, and King Mancera, Eddie Santiago. And it was cool because so everybody like it was nice. And it was free. It was free. Yeah. The carnivals in San Miguel are very, very good. I recommend. But this year, no carnival, correct? Virtual carnival. Really? It's virtual? Yeah. Oh, I don't know what will they do, but it will be virtual. No, I don't know. Who will watch? ¿Quién va a ver eso? Like, oh my God, I van. ¿Verdad que el que siempre ganaba la... Era una, una disco de... Que era bien famosa, de, de gays. Los que siempre ganaban la... Ma, Marquis, it was Marquis or something. Marquis, yes, Marquis. Man, but those were some very... In, in the parade... Man, they were good. They they had a very good caravan. Is th does that still exist? I think no. It was in front of Chef Carousel, I think. Of yeah. Roosevelt. No, no, but do they yeah, still participate? Be... Do they still participate in the I think no. I think no. Around because, 10 years. Maybe yeah. because I remember, I remember I must say, a, a, a pickup in Sarape. In Sarape. Yes. Yeah, man, so, because I remember La Curacao, and then it was stupid. It was a pickup and a woman saying bye, throwing candies. Boring, boring. But when, when Marquis and they, man, that was like Brazil carnival. Complete show. Man, some girls like, wow. It was a complete, it was, it was a very good show. Yeah. I, I, I really miss San Miguel. I, I, I had a lot of friends. I want to go to San Miguel one day, but no, it's too hot. <laughs> <laughs> November and December have a good weather to visit. Okay. When is the carnival of San Miguel? Is it on an exact date? No. It's the last. Uh, Saturday of November. Very good, yes. It's like Thanksgiving. It's the fourth Thursday of November. Eso me encanta. Y ojalá, así como están adoptando las leyes de... Están cambiando cosas. Me gustaría que empezaran a cambiar lo, lo, la, las fechas de festivos. Para Teacher. que siempre, siempre caiga. Yes? In Costa Rica... Since this year, uh, the government changed the, the holidays for uh, Monday. Always well, to the Monday. Yes, for me, that's excellent. For tourists, for increase the tourism. Yes. It's like, for example, in the United States, Mother's Day is always the first or second Monday. Um, 
El único the que is great here. <laughs> yes. El único que no cambia, of course, es Christmas y el 4 de julio, Independence. Pero ahí todos caen el, el primer viernes o algo de algo para que se haga long week. A long week in Colombia, too. Oh, yes. Yeah, maybe someday in the future here. Because imagine Christmas this year. Christmas this year is Friday. Friday the 24th. Friday. Saturday 25th, so it's Monday back to work. Ah, sucks. Oh, man. Yeah. I remember like two or three years ago, Christmas was like Monday 24th, Tuesday 25th. So it was like, it was Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. Straight. Yeah. Next year it won't be nice. Why? Oh yes, it's gonna be on a Sunday, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay, class. Then I will see you Monday. Yes. On Monday. Yes. On next Monday. Monday. Yes. Okay. Have a very very good weekend. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye, everybody. Good night, everyone. Good night.